I'm Rodney Yi, and I'll be your guide through yoga practice for strength. Yoga enriches your life. It can result in important discoveries about yourself. The Yoga Practice Series has been created to help you expand the practice of yoga in your daily life. As a yoga teacher, I've come to realize that no two people practicing yoga travel the same path to self-discovery. No two people experience this ancient system of self-care in the same way. Strength is one very significant aspect of yoga practice. As we age, it's something that we value more in our lives. Increased strength means greater vitality, greater resistance to everyday stresses. In this video, we'll focus on poses that develop strength, strength that leads to courage, clarity of mind, and self-confidence. You'll learn how to balance effort and surrender, and how to open your body to be fully alive in the world. I'll guide you through two complete yoga practice sessions. Your personal goals will determine which session you select. In the first session, we'll practice anaerobic vinyasa and inverted poses. The vinyasa to develop power and stamina, the inverted poses to soothe body and mind. In the second session, I'll teach standing and arm balances that will tone your muscles and enhance your self-confidence. The arm balances are challenging, so don't let them discourage you. It's the quality and consistency of your practice that's important. As you practice, remember, listen to what your body is telling you. Your strength will develop naturally. Give yourself the time to discover yoga's many, many rewards. This practice session begins with vinyasa, a series of flowing yoga poses that link breath and movement. We'll practice four progressively challenging sequences. Keep a consistent rhythm while observing the inner sensations of the body. As you become familiar with practicing vinyasa, draw your attention inward. Observe the relationship of body, breath, and mind. Go ahead and work vigorously, but always allow the breath to flow. If at any time you need to do less, repeat the previous sequence or rest in child's pose. We'll start this vinyasa in simple sitting pose. You may need a block. Vinyasa, sequence one. Begin in simple sitting pose. Sit with your big toes together, knees slightly apart. Inhale. Exhale, allow gravity to take your body forward. Let all the tension in the body dissolve. Relax and breathe. Inhale, stretch your arms over your head. Exhale, reach through the arms. Inhale, come to all fours. Exhale, turn your toes under. Inhale, exhale, dog pose. Lift the sitting bones, press the inner thighs back. Feel the hands on the ground. Feel the feet on the ground. Breathe. Inhale. Exhale, step the right foot forward into a lunge. Stretch through the back leg, lengthen the spine. Inhale. Exhale, left foot forward. Standing forward bend. Extend the legs vigorously and draw the body down. Inhale, lift the head and the chest. Exhale, step the right foot back to a lunge. 
Inhale, expand. Exhale, soften. Inhale. Exhale, dog pose. Inhale. Exhale, rest in child's pose. Sequence two. Inhale, arms overhead. Exhale. Inhale, all fours. Exhale, dog pose. Inhale, lengthen the spine. Exhale, lift the lower ribs toward the back. Breathe, soften the face. Receive with the senses. Inhale. Exhale, step the left foot forward between the hands to a lunge. Inhale. Exhale, right foot forward. Standing forward bend. Inhale, come up. Stretch the arms overhead. Exhale, release the arms. Mountain pose. Inhale, raise the arms. Exhale, standing forward bend. Inhale, lift the head and chest. Exhale, step the left foot back to a lunge. Inhale, stretch. Exhale, right foot back, dog pose. Inhale, use the strength of the legs to draw the weight of the body off the arms. Exhale, stretch the arms firmly toward the floor. Inhale. Exhale, release to plank pose. Inhale, lower all the way to the ground. Exhale, stretch through the legs, draw the elbows back. Inhale. Exhale, bend the legs, firm the thighs and the buttocks. Inhale, press your hands down and lift your chest to bent leg upward dog. Exhale, release to bent leg plank pose. Draw the elbows back. Inhale, straighten the legs. Exhale, all fours. Inhale, exhale, press back to dog pose. Inhale, exhale, bend both legs, lift the sitting bones. Inhale, jump into standing forward bend. Exhale, release down. Inhale, come up to mountain pose. Exhale, release the arms. Sequence three. Inhale, raise the arms over the head. Exhale. 
exhale, standing forward bend. Inhale, lift the head in the chest. Exhale, put your weight on your hands, jump back to dog pose. Inhale, expand. Exhale, soften the face. Inhale, exhale, lower to plank pose. Inhale, upward dog, shoulders broad. Exhale, lift the sitting bones to dog pose. Inhale, jump to standing forward bend. Exhale, release the spine down. Inhale, come up, arms overhead. Exhale, lower the arms. Mountain pose. Sequence four. Inhale, raise the arms. Exhale, standing forward bend. Inhale, lift the head in the chest. Exhale, jump back to dog pose. Inhale, exhale, plank pose. Inhale, upward dog. Exhale, dog pose. Inhale, exhale, right foot between the hands. Inhale, exhale, triangle pose. Use a block if you need to. Inhale, exhale, lunge. Inhale, exhale, dog pose. Inhale, exhale, left foot forward. Inhale, exhale, triangle pose. Inhale, exhale, lunge. Inhale, exhale, dog pose. Inhale, exhale, plank. 
plank pose. Inhale, upward dog. Exhale, dog pose. Inhale, exhale, step the right foot between the hands. Side stretch pose. Stretch the side of the body. Inhale, exhale, both hands on the floor, right foot back, dog pose. Inhale, exhale, left foot forward, side stretch pose. Exhale, dog pose. Inhale, exhale, jump to standing forward bend. Let the body release. Inhale, come up to mountain pose. If you want a more vigorous workout, repeat all or part of the vinyasa sequences. In this next sequence, we'll practice inverted poses. In positioning your body upside down, you'll experience yourself in a new way. From headstand preparations, you'll learn about endurance and self-confidence. Shoulder stand is a cooling pose. It soothes the nerves and increases vitality. Practiced regularly, they'll improve the alignment of your spine and release the habitual tension in your back and shoulders. We'll begin in simple sitting pose. Headstand preparations. Bent arm dog pose. Turn the toes under. Lift the hips and straighten the legs. Use the strength of the legs to draw the weight of the body off the arms. Soften the face. 
exhale, bend your elbows, forearms to the floor. Lengthen the spine. Press the legs back. Inhale, straighten the arms. Bend the elbows, lengthen, work the legs. Draw the ribs toward the back. Straighten the arms. Bend the elbows, lengthen again. Work the legs. Press back to dog pose. Rest in child's pose. Headstand touch. Come to all fours. Place your hands in headstand position. Interlace your fingers so the hands form a horseshoe shape, elbows directly under the shoulders. Turn the toes under, lift the hips, straighten the legs. Press the forearms into the floor, broaden the shoulders. Walk the feet in slightly, inhale, Exhale, lightly touch the top of your head to the floor, shoulders wide. Inhale, lift the head off the floor. Exhale, release the head between the hands. Breathe. Broaden the shoulders. Put a little more weight on the head this time. Broaden the shoulders. Inhale, lift the head off the floor. Exhale, rest in child's pose. To build more strength and endurance, we'll practice dog pose for two minutes. As your strength increases, you can practice for five minutes. Dog pose. Lift the sitting bones. Extend the heels toward the floor. Inhale, lengthen the spine. Exhale, press through the rim of the palms and stretch through the arms. Keep the legs active. Release the jaw. Soften your forehead, your eyes, your abdomen. Breathe into the chest and the belly. Observe the sensations in your body. Just a few more breaths. Fully extend again. Release to child's pose. 
let go. Bridge pose. Lie on your back, knees bent. Place your feet wider than hips distance apart. Turn the toes in slightly. Inhale, press the heels into the floor. Exhale, lift the hips. Interlace your fingers. Turn the shoulders under, stretch your arms away from you. Lift the chest towards the chin. Soften the neck. Press the inner heels down. Don't let the knees turn out. Firm the buttocks. Keep the legs active. Unclasp the hands, come down. Let's do it again. Inhale, keep your feet slightly turned in, press down, and lift your hips. Interlace the fingers, turn the shoulders under. Firm the buttocks. Inhale, open the chest. Exhale, receive the pose. Rest your hands on your lower abdomen. Feel it release toward the floor. Breathe. Roll onto your side. Come to simple sitting pose. In our next sequence, we'll practice shoulder stand and some variations. You'll need a chair, several blankets, a small towel, and a belt. Shoulder Stand Series. Place your blankets about a leg's length in front of your chair. Make sure the chair is stable. If you'd feel more secure, place the chair against a wall. Prepare the strap so when you place it around your upper arms, just slightly above the elbows, your arms are slightly wider than shoulder width apart. We'll begin the shoulder stand series with plow pose. Lie on your blankets, your shoulders about one to two inches from the edge. For comfort, you can place a small towel under your head. Inhale. Exhale, lift the legs of her head and place your toes on the chair. Turn your shoulders under and put your belt or your strap around your arms. Lift the hips toward the ceiling. Place your hands on your upper back as close to the shoulder blades as possible. Inhale, lengthen the spine. Exhale, press down with the toes and stretch through the legs. Inhale, exhale, Soften the face, the eyes, the mouth, the throat. Bring your hands lower on your back, closer to the shoulder blades if you can. Lift your left leg to vertical.
one-legged shoulder stand. Stretch both legs. Slightly roll both thighs in. Keep the right hip lifting. Inhale. Exhale. Soften your face. Your eyes. Breathe. Lower the left leg. Reestablish plow pose. Lift the hips from the strength of your thighs. Take the hands further down the back. Inhale, lift the right leg. Keep lifting the left thigh as you stretch through the right leg all the way through the foot. Lift the left leg. Shoulder stand. Make sure you are high on your shoulders. Inhale, exhale. Press the upper arms into the blankets and stretch both legs. Inhale, exhale, soften your throat, your face, and breathe. Lower the right leg to the chair. Lower the left leg. Remove the strap. Raise your arms overhead. Bend the legs, slowly roll down. Rest on the blankets. Move slightly toward the chair so your shoulders are on the floor. Rest with your legs bent knees together, or allow the knees to drop to the sides in reclined cobbler's pose. Rest. Inhale, draw the knees together. Exhale, roll onto your side. Come up. Move quietly. Maintain the openness and the sense of calm you've gained from practicing shoulder stand. As your practice matures, you can hold shoulder stand for up to 10 minutes. Leg stretches. For these poses, you need a strap. Lie on your back, legs outstretched. Bend your right leg into your chest. Place the strap around your foot. Straighten the leg. Stretch both legs vigorously. Inhale, exhale, soften the abdomen. If you're able, 
Release the strap and take hold of your big toe with your index and middle fingers of your right hand. Inhale. Exhale, lengthen the hamstring. Inhale. Exhale, slowly release the leg to the right. Press the left hip down as you stretch the right leg. Breathe naturally. Broaden through the arms, soften the face. Receive the stretch. Inhale, swing the leg to center. Bend the left leg. Now hold on to your right foot with your left hand. Shift your hips three inches to the right. Release the leg to the left. Keep both legs active. Feel the stretch in the outer hip. Inhale, raise the leg. Bend your left leg. Shift your hips back to center. Lower your right leg. Bend the left leg, hold on to the big toe or use the strap. Straighten the leg. Inhale, broaden the shoulders. Exhale, release the leg to the left. Keep the right hip down. Inhale. Exhale, open the chest. Extend through the right leg. Inhale, raise the leg. Bend your right leg. Shift the hips three inches to the left. Hold your left foot with your right hand. Straighten your right leg. Release the leg to the right. Feel the stretch in the left hip. Receive the pose. Inhale, raise your leg. Shift your hips back to center. Exhale, release. Relaxation pose. Rest with your legs extended. Palms up, eyes closed. Use relaxation to nourish yourself at the end of this challenging session. practice session, we'll be doing both standing and sitting poses that emphasize strength and balance. When balancing, there's an exhilaration that comes from trusting your body to support you. Balancing should feel fluid. If you're rigid like a statue, you're hardening your muscles and relying on them to support you. Your weight should be carried by your skeleton, leaving the muscles free for movement. Our practice session begins with a short vinyasa that includes an arm balance. Vinyasa, begin in simple sitting pose. Inhale, exhale, release forward into child's pose. Reach the arms overhead. Inhale, all fours. Exhale, dog pose. Stretch through the legs through the arms, lengthen the spine. Exhale, release to plank pose. Inhale, stretch back through the heels. Exhale, 
Inhale, Upward Dog. Exhale, Dog Pose. Turn onto the outside edge of your right foot. Lift the arm, side arm balance. Press the right arm down, stretch through the left arm. Breathe. Inhale. Exhale, dog pose. Inhale. Exhale, side arm balance to the left. Inhale, exhale, dog pose. Inhale, exhale, rest in child's pose. Let's repeat this vinyasa. Inhale, exhale, arms overhead. Inhale, exhale, dog pose. Inhale, exhale, plank pose. Inhale, upward dog. Exhale, dog pose. Side arm balance to the right. Breathe. Stretch through the legs. Stretch through the arms. Dog pose. Side arm balance to the left. Dog pose. Release to child's pose. Rest. You can repeat this vinyasa or be creative. Add poses to develop your practice. Add standing poses like triangle, side stretch, half moon in between each dog pose. Standing poses bring strength and proper alignment to the legs. They build a firm foundation and mental groundedness. Standing balances are tricky. From the outside, it appears that you are still. This next combination of poses will help you learn to feel the movement that is inherent within balancing. Your observation of the internal and external movements will bring presence and stillness to the mind. Mountain pose. Feel the strength of the legs and the softness of the abdomen. Inhale. Exhale. Observe the movement of the body. Observe how the weight is carried by the alignment of the skeleton. Maintain the equilibrium that you establish in mountain pose throughout the balances that follow. Triangle pose. Inhale, raise your arms. Exhale, jump your feet three and a half to four feet apart. Left foot in 15 degrees, right foot out 90. Inhale, exhale, release over the front leg. Inhale, exhale, extend the spine, turn to look at your hand. Feel your weight taken by the back leg and your feet in firm contact with the floor. Stretch through the arms, shoulders down. As you extend through the back leg and reach up with the arm, inhale, come up. Exhale, reverse the feet. 
Inhale. Exhale, triangle pose to the left. Look up at your top hand. Follow the rhythm of the breath. Observe the subtle movements of the body. Strengthen the back leg. Stretch through the top arm. Inhale, come up. Turn the feet forward. Take a slightly wider stride. Side stretch pose. Left foot in, right foot out. Bend the right leg to 90 degrees. Stretch over the right leg. Place your hand beside your ankle or on a block. Reach through the top arm as you stretch the right side of the waist. Stretch along the left side of your body, from the ankle to the hip, from the abdomen through the index finger. Soften the throat. Gently turn your head and look at your arm. From the strength of the back leg and the sweep of your top arm, inhale, come up. Feet forward. Reverse the feet. Inhale, exhale, bend the left leg. Release to the left. Inhale, exhale, lengthen both sides of the spine evenly. Turn to look up at your top arm. Breathe. Inhale, exhale, release the pose. Jump to mountain pose. Half moon pose. Inhale, exhale, jump your feet apart. Inhale, exhale, triangle pose. Bend the front leg. Place your hand on the floor in front of your right foot. Lift the back leg as you straighten the front leg. Inhale, extend the spine. Exhale, rotate the right thigh and press the sacrum forward. Stretch through the top leg. Observe that when you make a movement, even taking a breath, the balance is affected. Inhale, bend the front leg and lower the back leg to the floor. Triangle pose. Inhale, come up. Half moon pose to the left. Inhale, exhale, triangle pose. Bend the front leg. Shift your weight over the front foot. Inhale, come to half moon pose. Stretch through the arms and legs. Watch for the subtle internal movements in the body. Expand the pose from the inside. Inhale, exhale, release to triangle. Inhale, come up, feet parallel, jump to mountain pose. Standing forward bend. Inhale, raise your arms overhead. Exhale, bend forward. Hold your ankles, elbows bent. Release in the forward bend. Toes broad, legs firm and extended, sitting bones wide, inner thighs drawing back. Inhale, exhale, release from deep within the abdomen. Lengthen the neck from the broadness of the shoulders.
Inhale, come up, arms overhead. Exhale, mountain pose. Tree pose. Inhale, exhale, place your right foot high on your inner left thigh. Inhale, raise your arms overhead, palms facing or together. Press your foot and your thigh toward each other and let the right knee drop. Stretch both arms without pushing the bottom of your rib cage forward. Breathe. Balance. Inhale, exhale, release to mountain pose. Place the left foot on the inner right thigh. Keep the hips as square and even as possible. Inhale, lift your arms overhead, palms facing or touching. Continue to press the left foot into your thigh as you draw through both sides of the waist and stretch up through the arms. Inhale, exhale, release to mountain pose. Exalted warrior, jump the feet apart. Left foot in, right foot out. Inhale, raise the arms overhead, palms together. Exhale, turn to face your right leg. Inhale, strengthen the back leg. Exhale, bend the front leg to 90 degrees. Reach up through the arms, lift off the lower back. Look up. Inhale, exhale, soften your throat, your jaw, your eyes. Inhale, come up, exhale, Turn to the other side. Inhale, lengthen the spine. Exhale, maintain the strength of your back leg and bend the front leg to 90 degrees. Stretch through the arms. Look up. Breathe. Feel the majesty of exalted warrior. Inhale, come up. Exhale, face forward. Jump the feet together, mountain pose. Standing forward bend. Stand with your feet hip width apart. Inhale, raise your arms overhead. Exhale, release to standing forward bend. Clasp your ankles. Soften the abdomen and allow gravity to take you deeper into the pose. From here, we'll move into Brave Warrior. Release the arms. Place your fingertips on the floor and your left foot about a foot behind you. Exhale. Inhale, raise your torso, arms, and left leg. They should be parallel to the floor now. If you feel steady, bring your palms together and cross the thumbs. If you need support, practice with your forearms on a chair. Inhale, lengthen the spine. Keep the hips level. Gaze over the index fingers. Balance. Inhale, exhale, release to standing forward bend. Hold your elbows, rest. Inhale, exhale, lift your torso, arms, and right leg. Balance on the left foot. 
keep the standing legs strong, hips even. Stretch through the arms and the right leg. Balance. Feel the power of brave warrior. Release to standing forward bend. Feet hip width apart. Hold your heels or shins. Bend your arms out to the side. Firm the legs. Soften the abdomen. Let go of any tension. Inhale. Exhale. Broaden the back. The sitting bones. The back of the legs. Feel the balance between the two feet. Lightly adjust so your balance is even. Keep your mind receptive. Inhale, come up. Exhale, mountain pose. The sitting and arm balances develop arm and abdominal strength. Sometimes you may not be able to do them right away. Just keep practicing them to the best of your ability. Approach them like a child learns to walk. In your repetition of these poses, your confidence, strength, and understanding will develop. Work intensely, and at the same time, have fun. Be light and humorous. We'll finish this session with relaxation pose. Boat pose. Lie on your back, knees bent. Roll your spine up so that just the sacrum is on the ground. Extend the legs until your feet are at eye level. Extend the legs turning them slightly inward. Keep the chest broad as you reach through the arms. Inhale. Exhale, bend the legs. Roll back down, lie on the floor, legs bent. Let's do it again. Roll the spine up. Lift the legs. Inhale. Exhale. Firm the abdomen. Vigorously extend through the legs. Keep your breathing even. Release the pose. We'll continue with arm balances that develop abdominal strength. You'll need two blocks. Sit in simple sitting pose. Pendulum pose. Place a block beside each knee. Lift your hips. Cross your ankles, sit back down. Press your hands into the blocks and lift your feet and knees off the ground. Breathe, balance. If you can only lift the knees, that's okay. Release. Next, we'll practice this arm balance without the blocks. You can continue to practice with them if you need to. Change the cross of your ankles. Inhale. Exhale, lift the knees and feet. Inhale, press down through the arms. Exhale, soften the face. Release the pose. Crane pose. Come to a squatting position, knees apart. Draw your torso forward, upper arms pressing into your shins. Hands on the floor, shoulder width apart. Slowly lean your weight forward for crane pose preparation. Release to squatting position. 
Walk your arms further down for crane pose. Lean forward. Straighten the arms as you lift your feet one at a time. Keep the back rounded and draw the abdomen toward the spine. Look forward. Balance. Release. Line your back, knees bent. Observe the vibrancy in your body that comes from practicing these arm balances. Reclining twist. Place your arms out to the sides. Lift your hips and move them slightly to the right. Lift the legs towards the chest. Drop the knees to the left about two inches from the floor. Keep your shoulders on the floor. Turn your head to the right. Allow the back to arch slightly and the chest to open. Raise the legs. Place your feet on the floor. Shift the hips slightly to the left. Release the legs to the right. Turn the head to the left. Stretch through both arms. Allow the chest to open. Lift the legs, move your hips to center. Lower your feet to the floor. Relaxation pose. Bring your arms closer to your body, palms up. Extend your legs one at a time. Use this time to observe the subtle movements of the body, the breath, and the mind. It is in the union of these that you will discover true balance. <laughs>